Good morning. Grace and peace be multiplied to you all in Jesus' name. And we are live with Clint the Drone being the first person. And Adim Chinobi as we look at John chapter number 12. John chapter number 12. John chapter number 12. John chapter number 12. Amen. Uh, Leo Jo flexing the holiday. Paris. This tomorrow. Your, your exam is waiting for you, LFC. Owen, Owen, everyone, good morning. Happy birthday to you again, Owen. Thank God for your life. He don't miss church this evening. It's going to be powerful. Happy birthday to Awulika. Welcome, everyone. Shubola. New Wednesday girl. Okay, let's do this. Morning coin on here. We go there now. Mm. Yep, we have got a pin. Good morning, please, sir. When is the next stream of LFC class? Haven't been around in January. LFC is done till January. I'll be the next LFC class. Class, January. We're doing the last LDC right now. And um, we're way gone in. Awulika, happy birthday to you, my daughter. Grace and peace be multiplied to you in Jesus' name. Welcome to the beginning of the best days of your life in Jesus' name. Let's make our declaration and go to John chapter number 12, verse 1 to 3. 1, 2, 3, go. I am the righteousness of God in Christ Jesus. I am the redeemed of the Lord. All my sins are forgiven. I am passionately loved by God. I am powerfully helped by God. I am kept and protected by God. I enjoy angelic assistance. I am irrevocably blessed. I am eternally forgiven. I am the healed of the Lord. I enjoy divine health. I have the favor and the wisdom of God. I am fruitful. I flourish, excel, and prosper in all that I do. Nothing is against me. Nothing dies in my hands. I am never stranded. All things are working to get there for my good. God loves me more than the devil hates me. And grace is working for me. Let's make the declaration one more time. I am the righteousness of God in Christ Jesus. I am the redeemed of the Lord. All my sins are forgiven. I am passionately loved by God. I am powerfully helped by God. I am kept and protected by God. I enjoy angelic assistance. I am irrevocably blessed. I am eternally forgiven. I am the healed of the Lord. I enjoy divine health. I have the favor and the wisdom of God. I am fruitful. I flourish, excel, and prosper in all that I do. Nothing is against me. Nothing dies in my hands. I am never stranded. All things are working together for my good. God loves me more than the devil hates me. And grace is working for me. Glory to God. Glory to God. So this morning, we're reading out of John chapter number 12, verse 1 to the end. If this is your first time joining us, 
This is what we do every morning. We take a chapter of the Word of God and read the Bible. We're trying to build the culture of people who read the Bible every day. People just want to pray and shout amen to a prophetic word every morning. I see you. You're in the wrong place this morning. We're intentional about grooming and growing believers so that they can um, they know God's word for themselves. Glory to God. Here begins the reading of God's word. Father, bless your word in Jesus' name. We open up our eyes to see Christ out of the pages of the scriptures. Be glorified as we are edified in Jesus' name. Amen. Then, six days before the Passover, Jesus came to Bethany where Lazarus Okay, let me give context to John chapter 11, John chapter 12. We have to read John chapter 11, the last verse. It will give context to John chapter 12. So the last verse of John chapter 11, we studied yesterday. We're doing John chapter 12, but I just want to read John chapter 11 as a context uh, for John chapter 12, right? Now, both the chief priests and the Pharisees had given a command, a search warrant, that if anyone knew where he was, Jesus, that is, he should report it that they might seize him. Yeah? So, go to 12. That is a backdrop for 12. You see what I'm saying? Then six days before the Passover, Jesus came to Bethany where Lazarus, who had been dead, whom he had raised from the dead. There they made him a supper, and Martha, (laughs) does what Martha does best, served. But Lazarus was one of those who sat at the table with him. Then Mary took a pound of very costly oil of spikenard and anointed his the feet of jesus and wiped his feet his feet with her hair and the house was filled with the fragrance of the oil and the house was filled with the fragrance of the oil because of mary's worship but one of the disciples judas iscariot simon's son who would betray him said why was this fragrant oil not sold for 300 denarii and given to the poor? It's good. Let's stop wasting money. Let's take care of the poor. Let's take care of the poor. Let's make sure we take care of the poor. Let's not buy, spend money on frivolous things. This is said, verse 6, not that he cared for the poor, but because he was a thief. And I had the money box and he used to take what was put in it he was a thief judas has been a thief he was in charge of the treasury so all those people say why did they do this in church let's just spend the money give it to the poor you know it's good to give it to the poor humanity is my religion thieves it's not because they really care about the poor but it's an only brutal spirit right there. The bad one, they touch things small, small from the treasury offering box. Why did they why did they give the money to this? They don't have to give the money to this. We have to concentrate on the poor. You know, we have to it, when you hear those things, it's the spirit of Judas. Those people are actually only brutal somebody. The thieves. Is, it, is the spirit not them? Is the spirit of Judas? I don't know why they bought this um, big church. So if they can change this church to a hospital, Nigeria will be better. Have you heard those talks? Have you heard those very foolish talk? They can change this church now, like to, to a parastator, like a good school. Nigeria will be better. If they can change this thing now to orphanage now, to take care of the poor. Those people is the spirit of Judas. It's, you are a thief. So the Bible says. This is what the Bible says. So this he said, not because he cared about the poor, but because he was a thief and had the money box and he used to take what was put in it. 
They will tell you how to use money that is not your money, not their money rather. They want to show you how to spend your own money. You do have to give that kind of money to church. No, 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 no. Keep you can you can use it, they can use it to build hospital, you can use it to build schools, do orphanage, do um 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 do do charity. I mean, people are suffering. What are you people doing in the church? Just build things for yourself. No, you don't have to build. Check properly. Those guys are thieves. Those guys are thieves. So they are not saying it because they care. It's because it's this, it is the lebruku something in them that is making them say it. See, Pastor, I just, the way he was driving today, I don't know why should Pastor... Ah, I don't know whether pastor should drive a car like that too. Ah, ah, because if you sell that car now to take care of the poor people in the church, ah, 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 I don't, ah, you are a thief. I didn't say so. Jesus said so. Same people go and spend over five million naira in clubs. The same hypocrites. So next time you, you hear them, read verse five. She poured expensive ointment on Jesus. And it was a prophetic move. That ointment was preparing Jesus for his death. So next time they come to you, send them this script. You are a thief or a bruku somebody. That's who you are. I'm like, well, people be, you have to be, have to be nice. But Jesus called them. He called him a thief. I'm not holier than Jesus. You are a thief. You can live the life if you are one of them. Go to another place to shout amen. But because he was a thief and had the money box and would take out of it. So what they are just saying is that why don't I have this money to do what I want to do in my mind? Verse 7, but Jesus said, let her alone. She has kept this for the day of my burial. That means she's anointing me ahead of my burial. Then when you hear such things, Verse 8 is very important. For the poor, you have with you always. The poor you will always have amongst you. So poor people will not finish. So it's not this project that church is doing that we eradicate poverty. It's not the hospital that church must build that will take out poverty. I'm not saying we shouldn't do that. I'm just saying that's not our priority. That may not be the church priority at that, at, at that time. The poor you will always have amongst you, Jesus said. Always you have the poor amongst you. But to me, you do not have always. Verse 9, as we go. Now a great, now a great many of the Jews knew that he was there. And they came not for Jesus. Verse 9 is very powerful. You remember 11? The Bible says they had put a search warrant on Jesus to kill him. You see, to kill Jesus. Anyone who found him to seize him, right? Now, the great many of the Jews knew that he was there. And they came. But guess what? Not for Jesus' sake only but that they might see or also see Lazarus, whom he had raised from the dead. But the chief priest plotted to put Lazarus to death also, because on account, watch this, of him, many of the Jews went away and believed in Jesus. The Jews who plotted to kill Jesus, because Lazarus was on the table, they couldn't touch they believed in Jesus. I'm saying to you, God will give you evidence. I've seen better evidence that they will not be able to take you out. Your evidence will speak for you. The evidence that God will give to you will defend you. There was good evidence. They just couldn't do that. You see what I'm saying? The next day, a great multitude that had come to the feast when they heard that Jesus was coming to Jerusalem took branches of palm trees and went out to meet him and cried, Hosanna! Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. 
the king of Israel. I need to teach on that. Hosanna. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord, the king of Israel. Hosanna. I usually will teach there are two um, worship chant. One is Hosanna. The other is Hallelujah. Hosanna and Hallelujah are not the same. Hosanna and Hallelujah are not the same. For instance, you are not likely, I haven't found, if you are found, you can show me, to find Hallelujah before the cross. No. You are likely going to find Hosanna here before the cross. Because Hosanna is a chant that says, come and save us. Come and save us. That's what Hosanna is. Hosanna is our Savior is coming. Or as our Savior has come to save us. Come and save us. Hosanna, come and save us. Blesses the one who comes in the name of the Lord. Come and save us is what Hosanna is. Hallelujah means you already have the victory. It is done. So you won't find hallelujah. You won't find Hosanna after the cross. you find hallelujah to revelation. Hallelujah for the Lord God omnipotent reign it. So Hosanna has been fulfilled. This is a dispensation of hallelujah. Do you understand what I just said? Do you understand what I just said? Hosanna okay. in the highest that our king be lifted high. Oza. You know that song? It's a very powerful song. I like it. Jesus, you be lifted higher. That's the cross. That's a perfect song for before the cross. Hosanna in the highest. Let our king be lifted high. That lifted high is not to sit on the throne. The lifted high is to hang on the cross. Hi. How do I teach this one now? The lifted high is not to sit on the throne. The lifted high is to hang on the cross. For if I be lifted high, I will draw all men to me. Jesus said this speaking of the kind of death he would die. Hosanna him in the highest. Let our king be lifted high. That lifted high is not sitting on the throne. Lifted high is hanging on the cross. Are you listening to me? That's the problem. When you not teach truth like this, it looks like you are. I'm not attacking anybody. I'm just saying. I'm just the lift. To, when you say Jesus be lifted high, what you're actually saying is hang on the cross. That has been done. If I be lifted high from the earth, I would draw all men unto me. I would take all judgment to myself. I'm just teaching Bible. I'm not teaching my opinion. Please don't crucify me. Be lifted high is staying on the cross. Lifted high is not let him. No, you can't leave. Where are you lifting him to? Where are you lifting him to? If I be lifted high, high from the earth, I will draw all judgment to me. I'm teaching good. I'm, this is the gospel. <laughs> What's, it's okay. It's, ah, I mean, well, let me not say something else. No, this is the gospel. Lifted high is to stay on the cross. For if I be lifted high from the earth, I will draw all judgment. It's not to... Ele or Joe, leave my phone. Oh my God. I didn't see that coming. Jesus. Ele or Joe says to levitate. It's not. Calm down, calm down. Where do I get to this perform? Lifted high is not. Yeah, that's what we taught as praise. But there's a Bible meaning of lifted high. If I be lifted high from the earth, I will draw all judgment to me. So how do we lift him high? Let me ask you, Light Arkins. How do you lift him? From where, where are you lifting him to? You can't lift him anywhere now. Okay, maybe I should deal with this in church today too, in the... Pastor Larry, if you're here, please get a question. Or, or get, let me deal with this question of, of God is already lifted. Lifted high is crucifixion. 
So as you worship him, you lift him high. No, you're not lifting him up. To where he's already there. To where are you lifting him to? Now they ask. No. Yeah. We can lift the name of Jesus higher than our circumstances, but Christ be lifted high is is the original sky that you. He's the sky daddy. He's the can't lift. He's the sky daddy. With what do you want to lift him? You can't lift the most high high. There's, some, there's a reason it's called the most high. The most high. That means you can't lift the most high higher than where the most high is. Are you seeing one? You can't lift the most high higher than where the most high is. Okay, so Hosanna, well, I hope you got that. Hosanna is actually a chant that is before the cross. And um, the thing you are saying is, is paining me, the amount of cutter and tears while singing lifted high songs. Oh, sorry. You can't get any higher than the most high. The way they lift artists in the gospel. Somebody arrest the light Harkins. Arrest her for me, please. You see the way they lift artists in the concert. What are you saying? How do you lift him higher than what are you, what are you doing? Most I not be guy name now in real states with that. Do you understand? So most I not be guy not be guy name now in real name be that. It's most high for a reason. Someone said, perhaps screen. So, Hosanna, blessed is the one who comes in the name of the Lord, King of Israel. And then the Jews, when he had found a donkey, sat on it, and it is written, Fear, not daughter of Zion. Behold, your king is coming, sitting on a donkey's court. We lift you high away. We won't lift and go now. <laughs> Maybe you are lifting him in your consciousness. It's not moving anywhere. So what you can sing is you are lifted high. That's a better way to put. You are lifted high. Yahweh, Yahweh. You understand? Not, we lift you. No, we are not lifting you. We are acknowledging that you are lifted high. That's why they need a good pastor. It's good pastors that give birth to good songs. Papa, that's my song. I know it's your song, so don't distress me. So when you are singing, it's saying, just sing, you are lifted high. Yahweh, yeah. not believe. You can't lift him to where he is the most high. Most time, not be guy name, not position. His name is actually Zeno. Myra is our family name. His name, I hope Zeno is hearing this. He's Zeno. It's not. It's Zeno. Oh my God. Um, Johnson. The tenses matter. You are lifted high. Yahweh, Yahweh. No, we lift. You don't lift. You. He's the most high. Most high, not the guy name. Now, position when you're there. This has to sink. I know. What would I say, man? God will bless people from the Logic Church like Noble, like Neon Adejo, who are just releasing gospel songs because they have a good teacher. You understand? Behold, the king is coming, sitting on the donkey. Let's go for 16. I have a long way to go. But the disciples did not understand these things at the first. But when Jesus was glorified, then they remembered that these things were written about him, that they had done these things to him. Therefore, the people who were with him, he called with him when he called Lazarus out of the tomb and raised him from the dead, bore witness. Evidence day. For this reason, the people also met him because they heard that he had done this sign the pharisees therefore said amongst themselves you see that you are 
accomplishing nothing. Look, the world has gone after him. The men seek him. Every time I come here, things are shaking. Always shaking tables, people. No, I'm just teaching the truth. My, my, my darling, I'm just teaching the truth. <laughs> oh, baby girl, I'm just, thank you, Apostle. You're teaching really good. Thank you, thank you. I hope you also love me small. I'm just teaching the truth. <laughs> ah! I know that feeling. For this reason, the people also met him because they heard that he had what that he had done this sign. The Pharisees therefore said amongst themselves, you see that you are accomplishing nothing. Look, the world has gone after him. That would, that's somebody's testimony. The Pharisees therefore said amongst themselves, you see that you are accomplishing nothing. Look, the world has gone after you. They're trying to stop you, but they're going to see that the world has gone after you. They're trying to talk us down at the Logic Church, the Zenos and the Marios. But guess what? They will now see that the world has gone after us. And they may now join us. They may not, now they can join us. Verse 20, now there were certain Greeks amongst those who came to worship at the feast. Then they came to Philip, who was from Bethesda of Galilee, and said and asked him, saying, Sir, we wish to see Jesus. Philip came and told Andrew, and then and in turn Andrew, Andrew and Philip told Jesus. But Jesus answered them, saying, The hour has come that the Son of Man might be glorified. Most assuredly, I say to you, unless the grain of wheat falls to the ground and dies, it remains alone. But if it dies, it produces much again. What was he talking about? His death, his burial, and resurrection. If I abide alone, I cannot produce. But if I go into the floor and I am planted and I die, you call it death, but God calls it planting, and then there is fruit. God, glory to God. And he who loves his life will lose it, and he who hates his life in this world will keep it for eternal life. If anyone serves me, let him follow me. And here I, and where I am, there my servant will also will be also. If anyone serves me, him my father will honor. 27. Now my soul is troubled. Jesus is predicting the cross. Now my soul is troubled. And what shall I say? Father, save me from this hour? No. But for this purpose, I came to this hour. Father, glorify your name. Then a voice came from heaven saying, I have both glorified it and I will glorify it again. That means God answered him when he spoke. <laughs> Woo! I felt that. God answered him when he spoke. God is answering you. A voice came from heaven. He said, I have glorified it and I will glorify it again. I don't know who you are. You're not alone. You're going to get answers from God this week that will bless you. Glory, glory to God. Therefore, the people who stood by him, by and heard it said, it was thunder. Others said an angel has spoken to him, but it was Father who spoke to him. So it was not a whisper. They heard him, but it was like thunder. But Jesus could interpret what the Father was saying. Glory to God. Jesus answered and said, These voices did not come because of me, but for your sake. That means God would have spoken to me without even doing that. But he came for your sake. Now is the judgment of the world. Now the ruler of the world will be cast out. And if I, uh -huh, leave Jesus higher, leave Jesus higher, leave Jesus higher, leave Jesus higher. Are you here? The lifters of Jesus, where are you? Leave Jesus higher. And if I am lifted up from the earth, want to lift him higher, levitate him, levitate him, will draw all people to myself. The meaning there is that I will take all judgment to myself. It's not a praise and worship song. It's not a praise. It's a statement for the gospel. And if I, if I am lifted up from the earth, will draw all peoples to, I will draw all men to myself. See verse 33. 
This he said, signifying what death he would die. Are you seeing that? So he has been lifted already. No need. He has been what? Lifted. This he said, signifying by what death he would die. The people answered him, We have heard from the law that the Christ remains forever. How can you say the Son of Man must be lifted up? Very correct, sir. Jesus waited four days to rebuke their thought that after four days, the person is not here. Yeah, you're correct, sir. This is said signifying what death he should die. The people answered him, We have heard from the Lord that the Christ remains forever. How can you say the Son of Man be lifted up? Who is the Son of Man? Jesus said unto them, A little while longer the light is with you. Walk while you have the light, lest darkness overtake you. He who walks in darkness does not know where he is going. While you have the light, believe in the light that you may become sons of light. These things Jesus spoke and departed. And was hidden from them. But although he had done so many signs before them, they did not believe in him, that the word of Isaiah, the prophet, might be fulfilled, which he spoke, Lord, who has believed our report, and to whom is the arm of the Lord revealed? Therefore they could not believe, because as I had said, he was blinded. He has blinded their eyes and hardened their hearts, lest they should see with your eyes lest they should understand with your heart and tongue so that I should heal them. These things Isaiah said when he saw his glory and spoke of him. Nonetheless, even among the rulers, many believed in him, but because of the Pharisees, they did not confess him lest they should be put out of the synagogue. So Jesus had hidden believers, but they couldn't confess him. Let's just be put out of the synagogue. For they loved the praise of men more than the praise of God. Shame. Then Jesus cried out and said, He who believes in me believes not. He who believes in me believes not in me, but he who sent me. And he who sees me sees him who sent me. I have come as light into the world that whosoever believes in me should not abide in darkness. And if anyone hears my words and does not believe, I do not judge him, for I did not come to judge the world, but to save the world. He who rejects me and does not receive my words has that which judges him. The word that I have spoken will judge him in the last day. For I have not spoken on my own authority, but the Father who sent me gave me a command what I should say and what I should speak. And I know that this command is everlasting life. This command is everlasting life. What I'm commanded to teach or show you is everlasting life. Therefore, Whatever I speak, just as the Father has told me, so I speak. God bless the reading of his word. In Jesus' name, amen. Tomorrow morning at 7.30, we would read John chapter number 13. It will bless you. If you are in Lagos, please do not miss Midway Koinonia today. Um... At 6 o'clock, if you are in Abuja, fellowship with Abuja Church. If you are in London, follow the Logic Church underscore UK. If you are in, if you're on the mainland, you have a new venue now. It's beautiful. You make sure that you are there tomorrow, Thursday, for your service. It's going to be amazing. So, you guys, I, I plan to see you in church this evening. Were you blessed by John chapter number online soldiers we did? If you are in Port Harcourt, can you send 
me a DM. We are creating a Potter Court um, WhatsApp group. We are looking at Potter Court first quarter of 2024. Um, it's the first time I'm saying we're looking at Potter Court first quarter 2024. But Potter Court will have a different plan, plan for Potter Court. Send a DM that you are in PH and you are interested to join the work in Potter Court. And we will add you there. You're going to have a great day. Oh, guys. And if you are in Canada, send a DM. Just put your number and put Canada. If you are in Port Harcourt, put your number and put... If you are in London, follow the Logic Church underscore UK. Where I'm going to be there to preach in this month already in October. You cannot stream Atmosphere. Be there. Um, if you are in Canada, put your number and then you put Canada. Can I ask about some other praise and worship songs? Shoot. Jim Jones, I give you two minutes. If you're in Portaco, just put your number and put PH. We send your number to the to the group. If you're in Canada, put Canada and put your number. That's all we need you to do. Emmanuel Ekong plus blah 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 Portaco. Jeremiah Uzodike blah 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 Canada. Your number in Canada. Okay. Anointing for anointing doesn't fall on you. You already have the anointing within you. Break every chain. Are you the madman of Gadara? What chain are they breaking? Anointing doesn't fall on you. Anointing lives inside of you. Break every chain is for outreach, evangelism. You are breaking the chain, and you break the chain by preaching the gospel. You are not the madman of Gadara. Break every chain. Break every, who told you you are in chains? He whom the Son has set free is free. Indeed. Any other song? What I say? Why are you people laughing? What? What, you what, I, what I say? Well, power to break it. Who told you? Are you the madman of Gadara? Why are you breaking chains? He whom the son has set free is free indeed. Hmm? Okay. Anointing doesn't fall for the anointing that you have lives inside of you. Next, next, next. What else? What else? Next, 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 next. Break every chain. Break it. Who told you you are in chains? People about cook. I'm just saying. Why are you screaming, Neka? Calm down now. Why are you? Any other house? Any other thing we need to deal with? No, it's not violence, it's just the truth. Break every chain. Break every chain. Break every chain. Stop singing in the rubbish. Jumjos, are you done? I'm free indeed. In Christ I'm free indeed. That's what we sing. No chains are holding me. Is who my choose to. That's gospel. I'm free indeed. In Christ, I'm free indeed. No chains are holding me. It does how to sing every living soul. Are you a living soul? The first Adam was a living, living soul. The second Adam was a quickening spirit. I will pray, I will pray. People just want to find my trouble this morning. I'm done. Fresh outpouring of the spirit. That needs to be explained. There's nothing like that. It's from within. But every now and again, you, you get a fresh, because the Spirit of God is new every morning. It's a fresh revealing, but it's from within you. It's not jumping on top of you. Who's the son? Who's the son set free? Is free indeed. Those are gospel songs. Holy Spirit, you are welcome. Where did he go to? Where did he go to? Holy Spirit, you are welcome. Where did you take him to before? Where was he hiding? We acknowledge him. We don't welcome him. He's already with us. He's in us. We're in him and he's in us. We acknowledge him. He's not welcome. You understand what I'm saying? Where did you keep him? I'm just talking Bible. That's just, I hear, I enter into, you don't enter the Holy of Holies. How did you leave? Uber or taxify or boat? Oh, don't stress me now. 
You carry the Holy of Holies. I am in the Holy of Holies. I am in through the blood of... You enter. You enter. How did you leave? Uber, taxi, fire. Every day I enter. I enter. I enter. Who they carry you come out? August visitor. Well done. I am your I am your worship. I am your sacrifice. That's a new one. No. I am your sacrifice. I bring myself as the sacrifice. I the hear for some song. I the shock. I, I offer myself as your sacrifice. I am your sacrifice. I present myself. I am your sacrifice. Hmm? Jesus, no. Well, how shall we say to these things? What about invade the place? Invade this. <laughs> I don't know any song like that. I need to know the whole song. <laughs> invade this place. Yeah. Holy Ghost can um, Holy Ghost can invade the place. It's actually true. He can take over the place. But am I missing some of the stuff? Who's talking now? Christ is my firm foundation. That's gospel. That's gospel. Beautiful. Receive this living sacrifice. I am I am your sacrifice. I'm not the sacrifice. <laughs> I'm not all oh, oh, <laughs> Receive which, which sacrifice. I'm not the sacrifice. No. The sacrifice is Christ. I bring my eternal sacrifice, which is Jesus. Now what about we and the Holy Spirit being in partnership. I don't understand that. P Flo is my mom's birthday today. Oh, happy birthday to your mom. Grace and peace be multiplied to your mom in the name of Jesus. Amen. First it was fire and then not born to do do. I don't know about that one, please. When I do, people should leave me. So these people they are my friends, they are my they are my G's. But I surrender all. No, I receive it all. You do not. With my life laid down, I surrender. Which which life did you lay down? How did you where did you put it on the floor? Where is he here? He laid down his life. He surrendered all. You come to the altar to say I surrender all, then you go home with your car. The gospel shifts the attention from what you do to what he has done for you. You know? From fellowship to partnership, and we can change. Um, you and Orishema ask question again. Orishema, Orishema, what's the question? Please, can you show me, please? Orishema, where's the question? Sorry. Someone said their worship playlist is now empty. Hey, yeah, my worship playlist is full. I have life. Go and play it. I have life. Play it. Play new and other just songs. There will be gospel. Noboji, a lot of his new songs, not when he used to be in religion. You see a lot of. Uh uh. Who the son set free? Orishema, your question again, please. Can somebody help me ask Orishema's question? I just want to deal with that. I'm done for today. <sighs> Isn't there a verse being a living sacrifice? So, what does it mean? Can. And be for, oh, I'll deal with that in church today. Living sacrifice, I'll deal with it in church today. I'll deal the living sacrifice, then I'll deal with it in church today. Pastor Romans 12, Roman, I'll deal with it in church this evening. I'll deal with it well in church today. Living sacrifice, I'll deal with that in church today. But that's not what I am your sacrifice. Could that be a stem from yeah? You are not the sacrifice, no, Jesus is the sacrifice. Please, for show us your playlist. Chumjus, if you come to London next meeting, I'll give you playlist. It used to come once in two years. As I was saying, let my arrow breathe. He can't breathe necker. Zeno cannot be. Okay, see you this evening. Fantastic. Um, Pastor Larry, that's another question. Living sacrifice. 
Don't present yourself as a living sacrifice, please. That's not what he meant. I'll deal with that. I'm begging. Um, we could ask someone else. Okay. So we're in partnership with the Holy Spirit. It, that needs to be, yeah, you, you're right. Your partnership with the Holy Spirit is a good song. It needs to be, um, it needs to be taught properly. It means that the Spirit of God cannot move without you. He needs you to touch the word. He wants to touch the word through you. It's actually good. I think, um, is it Irene that has a song like that? If I remember um, well, that's a good song. It means you are partnering with the Holy Ghost. In that partnership is that God is using you to touch the world. And you and the Holy Ghost can change the world. That's good. 20 Christocentric gospel artists. So we can make a playlist. Okay. I'll sit to my guys. Between MVP, Gerard and Neon, I'll get you quick Christocentric and play Holy Ghost. You and I will change the world. Yeah, that's a good song. That's not bad. You and I will change the world. Yes. That's a good song. That's a powerful song. Great. What next? What next? How about the song, We Bring the Sacrifice of Praise into the House? Oh, not bad. Sacrifice of Praise. Yeah. As well, I want to use sacrifice. It's not a bad song. It needs to be. I need to show you from Hebrews. Yeah, we offer sacrifice of praise. Um... It means I'm praising you even when it's not convenient, so it becomes a sacrifice of praise, if you know what I mean. Shibom, shibom, that's what it means. Um, I think I've done well today. I need to take my, give myself, I give myself away. Hmm. Come, it needs, it needs, I don't know what was in the mind of the writer, so it can't, it's, it's, a, it's not clear enough, but I mean, you can sing it, it's fine. I mean, you guys don't make this thing another law. You just the, let the Lord lead you. You will know you're a child of God. You have been my student for a minute. Just make sure they don't levitate him. Um, you understand? No, it's Zinomairo, not my rest. It's Zinomairo, Zinomairo. <laughs> my beloved cousin. <laughs> my beloved cousin. It's not my rest, it's my beloved cousin. It's an LDC inside this, this present LDC. There's a Zinomairo like that, that is... It's a Zinomyro. It's a Zinomyro. He is a Zinomyrotic set tendencies. Well, guys, I'm going to holler at you later tomorrow morning by God's grace. I got to go. So this evening, don't miss this evening. We're going to have a great time. We're going to have a great time. I sense it's already. It's going to be good. We already have some good. I hope Pastor Larry took down the question or your, or Ms. Zulubanji took down the question so we can take it up from there. Okay, you are out. What of another measure? Soon shall be another measure. Why do you listen to another measure of what? Holiness. Holiness is all I want for. Holiness is all I need. No, you already have it. You don't. <laughs> Take my heart and change it. You already have a new heart. Like a stamply. No. You're already holy. What's the meaning of logic? Love of God in Christ. That is the meaning of logic. Non chi Esther. Welcome. Love of God in Christ. That's the meaning of logic. Holiness. Holiness is what I long for. You already have holiness. For Christ has been made holy to you. I got Jesus in my life. That's a beautiful song. That's a good song. Eben, good songs. Sinatch, good songs. Yeah. Take my heart, transform it. No. With tears and cut, I sang it. Holiness. 
holiness. It was my ringtone. It's what I long for. I, I sang it with tears in my, uh, in my very, with serious kata. Father, take my heart and mold it. God, say son, get born again. <laughs> get born again. That's it. Just get it. Get born again. Yeah. Oh, oh my God. Transform my heart. No. Go and stream. I have life. What of talk about? Which talk about? Talk about Labia. I don't see anything she's saying. Don't ask me about talk about. Ada, hey, good songs. Ada, hey, good songs. Tokpaya Labi, I don't know anything she used to say. Oh, I don't used to hear what she's saying. Somebody said Tokpaya Labi. No, say not good songs. I don't know. She, I'm not saying she's bad. I'm just, I don't used to hear anything um, she used to say. I don't know. To, I, see, I just go back. I don't know hear anything Tokpaya Labi. They talk. So don't ask me about Tokpaya Labi song. I walk to K, only a corner of Condero, and to Boba, a Joe Mama, a Joe Mama, oh, Joe. I don't see it. Anything. Nazar Basi has a lot of good songs, too, to be honest. Draw me close to you, get born again. Never let me go, get born again. You have drawn me close to me, to you. You will never let me go. That's how to sing it. Get born again if you want him to draw you close to you. Next, 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 next. I hear her. She sings deep scripture. I know the year, so I believe you. But uh, don't, I hear with it while I made this talk. And please read your Bible. I don't know. I don't. Honestly, I like it. Neon Adejo, good songs. Neon is my son. Neon Adejo, good songs. Good song. But in the moment, all the man and all for me, all the member bar, all the member bar, all the member bar, oh, Joe Bo, I know the year, ping, anything. What of Sumisola? She has some good songs. That's my child. She has good songs. Oh, oh. Ozana in the eyes. We already dealt with that now. Ozana in the eyes. Can you be? Don't distress me now. Victoria Renzi. Um, sometimes, since I don't for forgot how much, at this point I want to close. Dunsi also has some good songs, a lot of good songs, to be honest. Just some of these songs, I know they are from this. Say that not forgot. To me, favor, Ayo Vincent, Noboji, you see good songs there. Noboji recently, no Noboji of the Old Testament God in Christ Jesus. No, no, people, Sozo is calling me. Sozo is not calling me. Sozo is calling me. Sozo will come to this room. Sozo doesn't need to come in. Okay. All right. Yeah. Great man, take it. Good songs. Great man, take it. Good songs. No sir, good songs. Oh God, no sir, sound. No sir, good songs. No sir, good songs. So you should have, you have a lot of good songs too. Great man, take it. Good songs. Good songs. But you are not the sacrifice. Don't offer yourself as a sacrifice. What about Judy K? Judy K, good songs. What about Emmanuel? I don't, I don't know a lot of his songs, but he might hear his sound. Good song. T.Y. Bello has some good songs, too. You have it there. Freke Omo. Recent Freke Omo good songs. Recent Freke Omo, like in the last... Because I, I, I had the discussion with Freke about the gospel. is my man. Nathan Ebasi has a lot of good songs. I already said that. Judy K, good song. Judy K knows the gospel. Don Moy, I don't know. He gets some DJ. He gets some... I just want to be where you are. Where, I don't know where I did. When they sign me, draw me close. No. I don't want to worship from afar. Moses, please, all good songs. I tell you the truth. Yeah. Good songs. Good songs. Yeah. Christocentric songs. 
it must be centered on Christ. The tense is the finish. Time, time to take them to school. Hey, boss lady just said time to take them to school. I love you all. I love you all. I'll see you all this evening. Blessings.